My name is Michael Cullen, and, um, aka Speedo Mick, and I uh, run around the country raising money in my Speedos, my goggles and my hat. Okay, I got into charity work, um, first of all, by getting helped up because I've been homeless myself. People came up and he continued to try and help me and he never gave up on myself, even though I'd give, given up on myself. And, um, <clears throat> And I'm just following their example now by, by giving back charitably. Well, I'd swam the channel for the Sami community, first of all. And we needed £2,000 to get uh, to open a shelter for the winter months. So uh, I wanted to do it for them. We then began raising money for the Woodlands Hospice. It was £4,000 we'd raised and I, was, I had a £5,000 target. So I decided to go to an Everton game in my speedos, my goggles and my hat. They thought, well, who's this, who's this nutter? And found out what he was doing and then wanted to get involved and wanted to get on board and wanted to, to help him and, and raise more. So that's, that's kind of how it started. You know, at a football ground, you know what I mean, in front of 40,000 people each week, you know what I mean? That was, that was home games and away. You know what I mean? Which is very, you know, it's pretty scary when you've got everything knitting on your bum. But all the fans were just absolutely fantastic. All the away fans, you know what I mean? They understand, understood straight away what was happening. They knew I was doing a fundraising. Anyway, I'd, so I, I continued to raise money for the Woodlands Hospice and I uh, raised uh, £67,000 for them in the end. Accumulated now, it's about £120,000 now. Raise money, which is a. Uh, not bad for a man in his pants. <laughs> Mick, you're a truly amazing person, one of a kind, and we are so, so grateful here at Woodlands Hospice to have received all your support and for the money you've raised, our profile you've raised, and for the fun and, and kindness that you've shown to this hospice. Thank you so much. You are fantastic. Um, what would the world do without you? Thank you very much. The kids on oncology are going to benefit hugely from your efforts, so cheers. It's just a very, very specific form of insanity that makes the world a better place, um, that he suffers from. He just always gives everything he's got.